Hi, my name is Mark Watson and I'm here for Roland YouTube and today I'm going to take you through the fabulous new digital piano from Roland called the RD800. Roland has a history of RD pianos that are synonymous with stage pianos of excellence and this is no exception. So let's get right into this baby here. The RD800 has a brand new keyboard. It has not only ivory feel but ebony feel as well. So your black and your white keys feel just like the real thing. It also has a thousand increments in the sensitivity of the keyboard. That's a hundred times more than the previous keyboards. So when you're playing, it is absolutely superb. Wonderful stuff. It has an improved weight as well. So it's a little bit lighter than the previous models, which is fantastic. It has some new Supernatural piano models inside as well. These are brand new, brand spanking new. We've got a, a grand piano based on the V Grand. We also have an upright and some electric piano as well. So they're five brand new models. In saying that, uh, the Supernatural technology, we can also get it in and fine tune every individual note if you want to. You can fine tune the pitch, the resonance, and the hammer noise and all the different parameters for each individual note that you can change. That's great. Okay, let me introduce to you a brand new feature from Roland called Tone Color. Tone Color, hidden behind these beautifully illuminated knobs which are very easy to see in the dark while you're on stage, is a new addition that will adjust parameters depending on what instrument that you have chosen. For example, if we go to the pianos, Tone Color gives you a sweepable selection from mono through to stereo. So just a quick example of that. Mono, full stereo. That could be used when you're performing and perhaps you just want a smaller sound for when you're doing the verses and a bigger sound for when you're doing the choruses, for example. In the electric pianos, tone color does something really fabulous. It morphs you through the eras of electric pianos. So we can start off with the old silver top. You can sound it sounds very vintage and very, very cool. can morph through to Mark I pianos, Mark II pianos, right through to dyno pianos, where they input the EQ into the uh, electric pianos and it brings out the sound of the tines when the hammer's hitting the metal rods inside. If I select a clav, this will in fact alter the EQ. So you can boost your mids or cut your mids boost the bass and the treble. The organ is awesome. What happens here on tone color is the draw bars will start off with just the lower ones being pulled out, the lower harmonics, your 16, eight foot for example, with the Leslie simulator actually rotating quite slow. And as we increase, it brings in the higher draw bars and kicks in the Leslie. Again, very cool for live performance. When you're performing, you can sit back in the mix or bring it forwards for your solos. Very, very cool. So we have strings, and the strings are very lush, warm sounding strings. These strings are really, really good to support your band when you're playing and, and bring out the vocalist when they're doing a ballad. We have choirs and bass sounds as well, and a, a really good selection of just usable meat and potato sounds for gigging. So let's move on to live sets. Live sets combines four sounds together, four layers of sounds, which we can mix with these uh, sliders and also bring in with the buttons. This is very cool. At the moment, I've got a piano sound and a pad sound together. other sounds as well and they will be introduced slowly with my faders. It's a very very cool way to be able to arrange parts on the fly and introduce more sounds in your arrangement when you're performing live. It's awesome. There's also tone remain which means if I play something and then select a new sound, the original sounds will stay ringing on. So you're not going to get that cut off sound when you change patches. This is great. We also have an effects section. All the knobs here are just easy to get to. We've got a modulation effects which will just 
alter uh, an effect that you set up for that individual instrument. I turn that on. We're looking at a phaser right there. I can change the rate and the depth. We have tremolo. Again, rate and depth. Amp simulator. And above that, we have five bands of parametric EQ to be able to adjust. It's fantastic. The reverb button's right there. Everything's laid out really, really well, and it is a beautiful instrument to play. So that is the RD800, folks. A fantastic new addition to the electric piano from Roland. Go out and try one. You'll fall in love with it. My name is Mark Watson, and thank you for listening.